Peggy 16. Hello and welcome to Battlefleet Gothic Armada, a new RTS from Tindalos Interactive based on Games Workshop's much-loved tabletop game. Take to the stars with fully customizable Imperium, Chaos Orc, or Eldar fleets across multiple game modes in a full single-player campaign, where you'll unlock and customize ships, even leveling up your commanders from Port Moor. The world's first RTS game built in Unreal 4, Battlefleet Gothic Armada recreates in detail the ships of 40k from hundreds of meters to 8 kilometers long, pitting them out in solo and multiplayer skirmishes. Each faction has its own strengths and skills. The Imperium are heavily armored with a lot of torpedoes, powerful macro weapons, and harness the awesome Nova Cannon. The Chaos are fast with longer range than the other factions, utilizing powerful lances. The environments in Battlefleet Gothic also house many hazards and also opportunities. Position a ship behind the debris of a destroyed opponent to avoid a barrage of enemy torpedoes, or fly between an asteroid field as cover against projectiles. Hide within gas clouds, which makes it difficult to be hit. Damage is compartmental, and the skills you have at your disposal rely on the functionality of the responsible area of the ship. When damaged, the skill will not be usable and you'll either have to fight with your remaining skills or, if possible, warp out of the fight and return minutes later having undergone repairs. Some of the many ways to damage ships include micro abilities, which are offensive attacks activated when an enemy ship is in range, such as boarding parties from the launch bay, torpedoes, the Nova Cannon, and many more to come. The movement of ships can be manipulated by prioritizing maneuvers, increasing speed all ahead full, or by making high energy turns and even ramming the opponent. Ship detection also plays an important role, with probes and jammers able to detect or hide your ships from the enemy. Many of the skills in Battlefleet Gothic require careful positioning and planning in order to land a connecting blow, making management of ship movement an all-important part of the victory strategy. That should introduce you to the very basics of Battlefleet Gothic, but why don't we take a look at something more... chaotic. The Marks of Chaos are present and will have a dramatic effect on your attributes and skills. Feel the impact of Nurgle, Sinch, Slanish, and Korn. Those Chaos ships are led by Abaddon the Despoiler, War Master of the Black Legion at the head of the 12th Black Crusade with his planet killer able to destroy an entire planet. Battlefleet Gothic is coming to PC 2016. Stay tuned for more.